just see how the gas is prepared in the laboratory. There are three ways that it can be prepared. We have the first one, dehydrating methanoic acid using concentrated sulfuric six acid. So methanoic acid, and then you run concentrated sulfuric six acid into it, and the gas is generated, carbon two oxide, and then you have water as the other product. The gas is collected over water. And I need to mention at this early stage that carbon two oxide is a poisonous gas. So you have methanoic acid in the container, then we have concentrated sulfuric six acid running down, then you connect it to a gas jar which has been immersed in water, and so you collect the carbon two oxide gas. The second method is dehydrating oxalic acid, ethandioic acid, oxalic acid by use of concentrated sulfuric six acid. I know the, the many acids we mentioned and we have continued mentioning in form one and part of form two, they were all in solution form. Now here we have a case of an acid that is in solid form and that is oxalic acid. So this reaction produces both carbon four oxide and carbon two oxide gas. So remember our interest here is the carbon two oxide gas. So this gas, when the mixture is passed through a solution of concentrated sodium hydroxide solution, it removes the carbon four oxide gas. And then you're able to collect your carbon two oxide gas over water. So the other products will be water. So you have the carbon two oxide, carbon four oxide, and water. And as you can see in the setup, you still collect it over water. The third method of preparing carbon two oxide is passing carbon four oxide over heated charcoal. Carbon four, carbon four oxide over heated charcoal and that prepares or that uh, forms carbon two oxide. We have carbon two, carbon four oxide plus charcoal. Remember charcoal is carbon. It is heated, so the reaction is done at elevated temperatures. Then you have carbon two oxide as the product. Those are the three methods that we use to collect the gas. In all these methods, we collect the gas over water. So we'll go ahead and look.